Today's book, A Mind for Numbers by Barbara Oakley, PhD, a smart science-backed guide that teaches you how to learn anything effectively. Here's your one-minute summary of this great book. Think with both modes of your mind. Focused mode is laser sharp, perfect for tackling a problem. Diffuse mode lets your brain wander and connect ideas in the background. Switching between both is essential for breakthroughs. Chunk to conquer complexity. Break concepts into meaningful chunks so they move from your limited working memory into long-term storage, freeing your brain to tackle bigger problems. Make learning stick, space, not cram. You want to distribute practice over time, revisit ideas, let learning settle, and avoid fixation traps that block fresh thinking. I'm doing exactly this with Emerson right now in his chess. He just officially became a chess expert, which is pretty exciting. Passionate about becoming a grandmaster. We're using these ideas to help him master chess. Again, check out the notes for some more details. Use active methods. Don't just passively absorb. Passive activities like rereading feel productive, but often are. Teaching these ideas to someone else or explaining them or quizzing yourself builds deeper retention. It's harder, but it helps you learn more effectively. And you want to overcome procrastination with motion. Often, starting is harder than doing. Decide to just begin. The simple act of starting breaks inertia and builds momentum. This is one of my favorite ideas in the note, to conquer procrastination. The pain is in the anticipation, not the doing. It's a big idea. And learning ultimately isn't about magic. It's about using your brain well. So what will you tackle today using these smarter strategies? Get on that. And again, as always, check out the notes for more.